Hi, it's Matt from Hummel Aircraft. We're approaching the end of 2024. Just wanted to give you a quick uh, end of the year video. Um, you can see the two place is uh, still underway. Fuselage is essentially done, the engine's mounted, the spar is complete. Uh, we're expecting to have the wing done here in January, sitting on the gear maybe by February with some early testing, hopefully weather permitting in March or April. That's our goal. Um, we're hoping to beat that, but that's our goal. Um, things sometimes move to the right um, as business stays very busy in the ultralight uh, arena. Uh, behind me here is uh, what we're selling is our lightning build ultra cruiser. So this is a lightning build. This is how you would um, receive it. Um, Customer has only to put in uh, whatever instrumentation they want, uh, drop the engine in, could be a half Volkswagen, or it could be the Claris V-Twin, and uh, that's it. The rest of the airframe is built, the controls are in, instrument panel's in, um, landing gear's on, everything's ready to go. So this is a lightning build, um, you can find that on our website. So somebody that kind of was ready to go, uh, probably a three or four day event, they could have the lightning build uh, in a flyable condition at their shop. So pretty easy skills. Um, mounting the engine is all, all done with our manual. Uh, it comes with a wire harness, at least on the Claris V-Twin. And the half Volkswagen goes together really well too. So this airplane has some upgrades and some changes. Now we've got a single piece elevator attachment horn, eliminates the two pieces, which eliminates any slop in the system. We have a trim, trimmed out windshield assembly, a little bit nicer finished look. Takes a little more time to build, but it looks nice. It's more finished. This one also has the new style wing tips that are a kind of Composite on the bottom with metal on the top. Uh, it makes the wingtip a whole lot easier for a builder to take care of and build. And it also gives a nice place on the end of the wing um, to mount like a battery powered um, LED position light. Uh, and it gives you somewhere to hold your hand when you're moving the wings around as well. Um, so that's going to become our standard wingtip um, design going forward. This happens to be a tail dragger, um, and as you know, ultra cruisers um, in tail dragger configuration with either the half Volkswagen or the Claris V Twin are part 103 with no canopy. You can build this as a tricycle gear ultralight as well. It's a little closer to the ultralight weight, but it still does qualify. You just have to be really careful with limiting your instrumentation. Um, anytime we put a canopy on this, unfortunately, it puts it overweight by a few pounds. So these are purely ultralights with no canopy. Okay, so that's the uh, quick build, lightning build, uh, as we call it, Ultra Cruiser. This is what you would get if you ordered one. Currently, our lightning build is about a six-month lead time at the moment. Um, comes and goes a little um, as time happens, but right now we're about a six-month lead time. We're about six or eight weeks on kits at the moment. Um, could change, but that's where we are today. Um, so I encourage you to go to our website often and check things out. Uh, we have a lot of stuff going on. You're gonna see more videos coming out for the Two Place. Uh, the Two Place does have a name. It's called the Rialta, which is, my understanding is Celtic for Shining Star. Um, that's gonna be the, the aircraft name. We, we uh, debated making it a number like the H5 or an H6 or an H7. <clears throat> However, uh, we wanted to kind of go with a different naming convention uh, for, for a lot of reasons. Um, so we kind of like Rialta, so that's kind of what we went with. So uh, we're gonna have a, our own webpage dedicated to that aircraft. Uh, we're gonna start populating that with images, drawings, videos, information and performance data as it becomes available. Uh, we expect this to be a kit product, uh, maybe moving into a build center kind of a situation, but it's going to start as a kit product initially. Um, 
We don't anticipate being a plans built airplane. Um, it's not a difficult airplane to build, at least not at this point, uh, but we don't expect it to be a plans uh, built airplane. We expect it to be kit built only. It has a 160 horse aero momentum turbocharged engine with a firewall mount. As you can see, that's uh, all CNC machine, no welding. It's got a large tip up canopy. Very similar to the other Ultra Cruiser and H5 models. Uh, this is the canopy we're starting with. We may move to a sliding canopy in the future, but for the first test vehicle, that's what it's going to be. Um, tandem seating, quite a lot of room in the airplane. A lot of height for tall people to sit. Uh, and your, your seat, uh, when you sit in it, your legs lay down into this belly section here, so it's more like a Riding in a Ford pickup truck, so it's a nice, comfortable seating arrangement for front and back passengers. All metal construction, uh, no carbon fiber, no wood. Uh, very few welded parts anywhere. The only welded parts are going to probably be the landing gear and a couple of uh, control bell cranks here and there. Uh, but that's it. There will be no other welded components. So that's underway. Uh, wing spar is built. It's behind it. Uh, it's a pretty substantial spar. It's a one-piece spar, kind of like a Mooney. Uh, you can see it there on the stand. That's all riveted and ready to go, uh, go together. That'll be happening in the next few weeks, um, since the ribs and the skins are already complete as well. That'll be going together very soon. The uh, H5 is still clipping along pretty well. We uh, uh, have sold a few of those this year. Um, our big seller, uh, no surprise, has been Ultra Cruiser. Uh, we've built quite a few rate of flies. We've built quite a few of these quick builds and we've got several kits out and we have several schools actually that are running kits with their kids, high school kids and early college kids. Um, so we're excited about that market and we think that's going to continue uh, into 2025. So check us out at HummelAircraft.com or give us a call anytime 734-548-4772. And Merry Christmas. Happy New Year.